at the Institute for Airway Sciences at the Icon School of Medicine at Mount Sinai, our team of physicians and researchers are breaking scientific boundaries to advance treatments for patients with diseases affecting everything from the sinuses to the lungs. After 30 years of research, Mount Sinai completed the first successful human tracheal transplantation, something that was previously believed to be impossible. As a result of this and many other groundbreaking advancements, Mount Sinai has established the Institute for Airway Sciences. The goals of the Institute are really threefold. The first is to expeditiously transition basic science discoveries into clinical trials that are going to benefit patient care. The second is to improve the care of patients with creative and innovative research programs. And finally, the third is to encourage progress in airway science. Every breath we take exposes our body to bacteria, viruses, and the environmental toxins. Bringing Mount Sinai experts together will increase our understanding of the respiratory system and its ability to heal itself, and our ability to identify novel approaches to treat diseases affecting the sinuses, larynx, trachea, esophagus, and the lungs, including COPD and asthma. Airway damage is becoming more common due to increases in viruses, cancer, bacterial infections, and trauma. The team at the Institute for Airway Sciences is dedicated to understanding how the lung and airway epithelium are impacted by injury and the ways in which the organ and body work together to repair and regenerate a fully functional tissue. There is a pressing need to investigate how the airway and epithelia respond to disease, injury, and environmental exposures. That's why we are going beyond traditional airway research to integrate stem cell science, epithelial biology, and immunology to understand diseases that affect the lung, the trachea, and the respiratory tract. Lung transplantation is an effective intervention for patients with end-stage lung disease who have exhausted all other medical options. However, the five-year survival rate for patients who've had lung transplants is significantly lower than other organs. Critical research is being conducted at the Institute to study what causes the high incidence of chronic rejection post-transplant. We are implementing cutting-edge technologies to develop and repair lung tissue, tracheal tissue, and advance airway transplantation. Through this institute, we're seeking answers as to how airway diseases are contracted, transmitted, treated, and most importantly, prevented. The institute is unique as we bring together basic scientists, clinicians, and clinical trialists to discover and implement new treatments that will impact our patients today and for years to come.